This video was brought to you by Technically Not a Technician. In today's video we'll show you how you can access Grandpa Simpson on your arcade 1UP, or any Simpsons bowling arcade for that matter. He's a fun easter egg, that you can show your friends, and to be honest his stats aren't that bad. Stay all the way till the end for a little gameplay. We'll start by simply applying power to the cabinet, and letting it boot up. At the time of making this video these Simpsons Arcade 1UP cabs are very popular. I believe that's because of the great deals people are finding, and I think it's because it's very easy to add the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles games to the unit. In fact if you'd like to add the two Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles to your Arcade 1UP check out the video above or in the description for more. Once your arcade cabinet is booted, simply select the Simpsons Bowling ROM from the built-in launcher, and let the game start as normal. After the Bowling ROM has started, start a game by pressing the player button on your control panel. I will simply select a single player, then select standard game, and last I'll select normal controls. I'm not sure any of those selections matter. What does matter is this next step. After the game has started, and is prompting you to make a player selection. Quickly spin your trackball down, then quickly spin your trackball up. If you've done this right you should now have access to Grandpa Simpson. That is awesome, but does this work on main? Can we get Grandpa Simpson to visit the nice people at home with main cabinets? Let's find out. Here we have a main cabinet I'm working on. This unit is running Windows 10 Enterprise, with a track mode as the front end. This unit is being modified to play trackball games. I'm centering this unit around first-person shooter cabinets like The Grid, War Final Assault, and Quake Arcade Tournament Edition. This unit will also have all the classics. I'm going to let the ROM boot up, however I'll speed this up for everyone. We'll be doing this the same as we did on the arcade one up, the only difference will be that this unit is not on free play. Because of this I'll simply press my coin button twice simulating a coin entering the coin slot. Just as before, I'll select the single player. Then I'll select standard game. The last selection will be normal controls. Once again we will spin the trackball very quickly in the reverse direction, and then quickly spin the trackball forward a few times. After this, and if we've done it right we should have access to Grandpa, and as you can see he has some nice stats. Also, I kind of wanted to jump on this main unit, as I'm able to record the screen on that unit very easily, and that's what's bringing you this great gameplay. I hope you enjoy the game demo. I do want to point out that Grandpa looks a little unfinished. Check out the background after a spare or strike and let me know what you think in the comments section below. I would love to hear your thoughts. Also, as you're watching this gameplay, please help a starving artist by clicking on that subscribe button. If you don't subscribe maybe at least leave me a like. If you really like the video you could do both. Like the video and subscribe. Maybe even comment and share it with a friend.
Thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it and found it informative. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. It really helps the channel grow.